Keyvokers. What up, guys? This is Keyvokers. Back here again with another achievement guide. Today we're going to be focusing on Super Destronaut DX. This game was developed by Petite Games and published by Radalaka. This one has about a 20 minute completion time, making it a super easy 1000 gamer score or platinum trophy. On top of that, it's only $5. You're going to have to play the game a bit in all four game modes to get the full completion. For now, we're going to start with classic mode and then we'll go into time attack, hardcore, and then into the challenges. So basically guys, this is a Space Invader clone. We're going to go ahead and start up classic mode. For classic mode, all we need to do is get all the way to 100,000. Once you start up classic mode, you can just let the enemies kill you. You're going to get an achievement for dying for your first time. After you get that achievement, we can actually go for the 100,000 score. I don't think this is too hard, but I suppose it is skill dependent. All you need to do is tap A to shoot. That's pretty much the only thing you have to do is shoot and move left to right. You're going to get an achievement or trophy for killing your first enemy. And you're going to realize while you play that some of the enemies, after you shoot them, they'll fall down and they'll turn gray. If you shoot one of those enemies, you're going to get the persistent achievement. That's for 80 gamer score. Besides that, all we need to do is make sure that we get above 100,000 score. Your score is on the upper left hand side of the screen. Once you get past 100,000, you can go ahead and let the enemy kill you. You're going to pop two achievements, one for getting 50,000 score and one for 100,000 score. And next we're going to be diving into the other three modes, starting with the time attack. Just got that second achievement, so we can go ahead and quit to the main menu and start up the time attack mode. Now time attack mode is pretty simple, it's a 1 minute and 30 second long level. So we simply need to make it until the time runs out. After the time runs out, your achievement or trophy will pop. The achievement itself is for getting 10,000 points in time attack mode. However, you can't die in time attack mode, so you do have to finish the whole 1 minute and 30 seconds. Next, we're going to go into hardcore mode. There's one achievement or trophy associated with this mode. And honestly, it's pretty simple, like ridiculously simple. All you got to do is get 1,000 points and then die. That's going to give you an achievement for 80 gamer score for saving the galaxy. So we only have one more mode to dive into, guys. That's going to be the challenge mode. There's going to be 30 challenges total in the game, however we only need to play the first 12 challenges. We're going to get an achievement for completing our first challenge, our third challenge, our sixth challenge, and our twelfth challenge. Each challenge is going to have a different objective. For example, the first challenge is to simply get 10,000 points, which is really easy. The first 12 challenges are really easy, none of them are really difficult at all. It's really only going to take about 10 minutes or less to get all 12 challenges done. The 12th challenge is going to be for hitting one of the great enemies 20 times. You can do it on two separate enemies. So you're just going to hit one great enemy like 10 times and then you're going to shoot another great enemy 10 times for a total of 20 times. And there we go guys, another full completion or platinum trophy. As always, I appreciate you guys tuning in. If this video helped you out, please leave a comment and don't forget like and subscribe.